Hello friends, welcome to EC Academy. In this lecture, we will discuss about the working of N-channel enhancement type of MOSFET. The enhancement type of MOSFET doesn't have any channel in between the doping region. Now let us connect voltage between drain and source and gate and source. So we will take the first condition where we will connect VGS is equal to 0 and we will make VDS as some positive voltage. Let us connect. So we are making VGS as 0 just connect a wire here to source and make this as ground so this will make uh, vgs as zero now let us connect vds some positive voltage positive negative and it is connected to source and source and substrate region is internally connected this voltage is VDS which is positive and negative. Due to this connection since the channel is absent is uh, absent no current flows the current will be equal to 0. Hope you understood this. So since there is no channel here so even though we are making VDS as positive the current will become 0 this is very important you need to remember this so we will take the second case where we will make VGS as some positive voltage and we will make VDS again as positive voltage ok so let us make this as positive voltage this will be positive and negative towards the source. So we made gate terminal as positive and drain terminal again as positive. Due to positive gate some of the electrons which are present in P substrate will start to accumulate towards the gate. They will accumulate towards the gate. Once the sufficient amount of electrons are accumulated towards the gate these electrons will start moving towards the drain these electrons will move towards the drain so this will constitute the drain current id id start increasing so the gate voltage for which the current start conducting in an enhancement type of mosfet we'll call that as threshold voltage now if we take the graph if we plot uh, VGS which is positive now versus ID the MOSFET will not conduct up to some voltage and once the sufficient amount of electrons are accumulated towards the gate the MOSFET start conducting electric current the voltage from where the MOSFET start conducting uh, the current is known as the threshold voltage the voltage is known as the threshold voltage. So this is the minimum voltage that has to be provided across the gate terminal so that the MOSFET start conducting. So threshold voltage is the minimum voltage you have to connect across the gate minimum positive voltage you have to connect across the gate so that the MOSFET start conducting. Since the channel does not exist earlier and it was enhanced by the application of voltage across the gate, hence this type of MOSFET is known as enhancement type of MOSFET. Now the VGS is fixed, now VGS will be fixed or made constant and this voltage will be above threshold voltage. So we need to always connect VGS which should be more than this voltage so that the MOSFET should conduct. Now the VGS is made constant and it is made above VTH so that the MOSFET is conducting and we keep on increasing uh, VDS. If we increase VDS 
the current will also increase the drain current will also increase the drain current will also increase and the depletion region which is present between the n channel and p channel will also increase depletion region will also increase towards drain as we increase vds the depletion width towards the drain this is the depletion region between n and uh, p region and this will increase you can see this depletion region will increase and the channel become narrow hence the current will become constant so if we plot the drain characteristics if we plot the drain characteristics it is vds versus id so the current increases initially linearly once the channel become constant the current become constant now if vgs is increased from let us say earlier vgs was 3 volts now let us increase vgs for 3.2 volts and then it is kept as constant at this case if we start increasing voltage between drain and source the current will also increase here so the current id will also increase because we have increased voltage across uh, gate and source it will accumulate more electrons are towards the gate so that will make the current to increase so we will get a different level of current so let us say this is for vgs is equal to 3 volts and this will be for vgs is equal to 3.2 volts hope you have understood the topic thank you